Hi, welcome back to the craziness. Y'all, I am so excited. Today we are decorating for crema, as I like to call it. Not Christmas, but crema. I'm excited. I've got all my stuff pulled out. It's in the office. The house is a complete wreck, but I'm going to bring y'all along with me. I'm going to do a little bit of cleaning, tidying up, and then we're going to decorate in the living room. And I think I'm going to go ahead and decorate the staircase as well and see how I feel and how crazy the kids drive me today and what I can get done. If you are new, my name is Wynn, and I am a stay-at-home mom of three. I have a mommy lifestyle channel. Um, you will find a whole bunch of mommy craziness here on my channel. So if you feel like you will enjoy this crazy content, please do not hesitate to subscribe. I don't think there's much more to say. Are you guys ready? We're decorating for Christmas. Let's go. It's cold outside. Okay, y'all. So just to start off, I'm going to clean up the mess that was left after I got the fire going. It's a pretty messy job, as you can imagine, with a wood-burning fireplace, but I love it. We always enjoy it. I am going to go ahead and clear out the corner for the Christmas tree. This is where I normally keep the toy bin for the kids. So I'm going to remove it from this corner because the tree is going right here. And it is the weekend, so I'm not going to be going crazy cleaning. My babies were down here playing when I filmed this. Everything will be okay. Cause all I want to do is spend this holiday with you. Okay, y'all. Let's talk about the tree. The tree that I'm using here in the living room, I purchased new. You know, my husband's going to kill me. But I wanted something that would fit nicely in this corner. So I think I mentioned this to y'all before. I'm not putting any ornaments on this tree. Um, I'm really into Scandinavian Nordic minimalist, I guess inspired decor and this particular tree will not have any ornaments on it you will probably hear all kinds of god knows what dylan is over here playing um so this one will be naked i will be doing a, another tree in the office that's going to be like the kids tree it's going to be filled with all of the amazing ornaments and stuff that they have come hung with over the years so that's going to be the fun tree in the office which is right there still visible from the living room let's get this tree set up Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything to be perfect for this week. Tomorrow. tree is done for now as I mentioned before it's gonna stay naked I do think I might need to put a topper on it I don't know though I have a traditional star one but I don't know if I will like the way that looks with just the bear tree I don't know so I'm still toying around with the idea of some kind of tree topper so y'all let me know if I should put a topper on the tree or what kind what what you would recommend I'm still thinking about it, but I have time. It's early. So let's move on to the mantle. Y'all, the mantle is the first thing you see when you walk in my living room. So I like to make it pretty. And the star is always 
the garland. Okay, so I picked up a garland here recently at Kirkland's. They were having 25% off Christmas decor. When I went in the store, they were also giving out 20% off coupons that I could stack on top of the 25% off. So it was an amazing deal. I got a really good deal on this garland and it's beautiful. So I'm going to wipe the mantle down. I've already cleaned everything off of it. Wipe it down and get to decorate. So like the more denim blue, I guess, in um, off-white ones, I'm going to pull those off and either put some plain black ones on there or um, just some antler ones that I have. I'm going to play around with it and see what I want to do. But so far, everything is looking really good. I love the way it's coming together. And I'm also going to put the stocking hangers under here. I'm not going to put the stockings up yet. Um, probably a little bit closer for Christmas. I'll put those up. But I am going to go ahead and put the hangers under the garland. So last year after Christmas, I knew that I was gonna be transitioning my house to black and white, Scandinavian style. So I picked these up after Christmas last year and they were at least 50% off, I can't remember. But um, it's a ton of ornaments in here. They do have, some of them do have um, some sparkle to them. I also got these ones last year after Christmas. They're like a, um, I forget what you call the, those things, but okay. I have several of these, and then I got some of these furry wreath ones, which are really pretty, and they match my tree skirt, and then I have some antler ones somewhere. I have to dig them out, but yeah, I'm going to remove the blue ones that are on there and put some different ones. these two floral arrangements they're very um, simple just a lot of greenery some pine cones I'm gonna put these two together and put them on the entertainment center like right below the TV I'm, I'm gonna add some battery operated like mini string lights to these and I think that's about all I'm gonna do up here I'm gonna keep it kind of simple but we shall see so I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this thing down and place these babies up there. And my friends by my side, but it's not the same. Santa, I'm smiling, but feeling empty inside. Cause all of the presents are still by the tree. They don't mean a thing till he's here with me. If you know. 
Of what the finished product looks like so pretty I love this pencil tree y'all it is amazing quality now I did put the stockings up just to show you guys what they would look like but I did take them down for the time being but this is what they look like sometimes my husband and I use stockings sometimes we don't this year I just decided I would put the kids stockings up I love the way it looks all of the fur accents mesh well this pillow came from Kirkland's this year. Got a really good deal on it. These reindeer came from Target years ago. They're probably older than my marriage and I have used them religiously every Christmas season. They're beautiful. So I am still on the hunt for the perfect understated Christmas pillows for the couch. So for now, it is bare. And I'm thinking I'm going to put some black ornaments on those centerpieces. The stockings came from a variety of places, but this black and white buffalo check one came from Hobby Lobby several years ago, I'm pretty sure. And I love everything. I love the way it came together. No outside, miss the things we did. Praise the Lord. Okay, so it's the next day. I spent most of yesterday off and on working in the living room. Y'all know how it is, mom life. So today I am gonna be working on the staircase. I'm gonna put some garland and stuff on the banister to make it look a little bit more festive. The staircase is a work in progress. When we bought this house, it was just not in good shape. I did remove the carpet from it, um, but the banister itself, it's just, it needs to be replaced. So. That is another project for another day. Today, I'm just going to be decorating it, making it look nice. Um, putting lipstick on a pig, essentially. You guys ready? <laughs> 